100% free boys desk. All right, boys only. This desk, <laughs> it'll explode if you're a girl and you use it. I'm not sure what it'll do if you're non-binary, but don't try it, it's boys only. <laughs> Some crazy stuff happens if anyone that's not a boy uses this desk. In Houston, Texas, men's salons aren't your grandparents' salons. Welcome to the Tuna Manly Salon. We have free beer. That seems like a horrible idea to have alcohol around scissors and razor blades and stuff. But hey, they got shuffleboard. <laughs> The manliest sport of all, shuffleboard. Go get your tune up, men. Only men understand the fun of playing with sticks. Dad, check out the stick I found. Very nice. Sick stick, kid. Looks sturdy. Yep, it does. Whoa, it's so straight. Good stick, buddy. I like it. Not bad. Great stick. Why are they so excited about that stick? Well, it is a cool stick. You harlot, don't you know anything? I like the idea of them using old timey like, <laughs> just getting real old old timey with uh, with the words you're throwing her way. You wouldn't know anything about the stick. Now I gotta go drill oil because that's a man's thing to do. Lady toilet paper. <laughs> I like that. What makes it, uh, is that it's in gold, like what I'm assuming the brand name is. So why is it lady toilet paper? What, what gives this the feminine touch? I have to know. I just Googled it, but I can't read the language. So I, I don't know why, but we'll trust it. We'll trust it just based on the packaging. That's very, you know, it's for, for the ladies. Women and men, look at the bags they use for school, traveling, hanging out at the beach. Men use the same bag. <laughs> Silly women and their accessorizing. I feel insulted because I, I use the same bag everywhere, but it's because I'm too lazy to accessorize, all right? It's not, not about <laughs> like gender wars. I just don't want to go buy another bag, all right? All right? Thrust your hips to pee. Ah, I see. Yeah, that's how it's done. That is exactly how it's done on both sides. You gotta, you gotta bend and snap to piss. It's real. It's how you do it. Don't know if this has been posted before, but gendered pickles? <laughs> we got the big poppy and the sour sis. Which one are you? And we have our non-binary option, the dill pickle. For however you're feeling. <laughs> I don't fucking know, dude. How will I know what treats to give my male dog? Oh no, I got treats for a good boy, but treats for a good girl, they don't, they, they, they're the same thing. They're the exact same treat, they just, I can't lie, that seems like a smart business idea. You're gonna fool people who didn't read like what's in it. They're gonna go, oh, I have two dogs, one's a boy, one's a girl, I gotta, I gotta buy both of them. I don't know, this seems like a pretty solid marketing scheme for them. Again, my favorite thing with analogy is pizza. One thing I have noticed, I think a comment pointed this out, is uh, why wouldn't I wanna have the rest of the pizza if I'm at a pizza place? Single slice Andy's go into the men's room. But if you got the whole pie, go ahead and use the women's room. I don't know. I, 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 nine times out of nine, I would take the whole pie. So if you want me to judge based on how much pizza I've had, you're woefully mistaken woefully mistaken even. Wondering why this is a thing. Soft feel lady. W what, are, what are these? Trying to, whoa, what's, what, what, what is this brand? Why is there a pine cone here? Soft white, soft feel. What are these? Are these Srixon is a sports brand, is that true? Is that what we're looking at? These are golf balls? I found it, I found the description, let's read this. Whether off the tee or around the greens, the new soft feel lives up to its namesake. With it, you'll experience a solid yet comfortable impact on every swing, giving you more confidence as you address each shot. And that's why it's for the ladies. Oh, it, it, it explain. there's a post. I, I do the thing where I research before I read the next post. Oopsies. The box out of context gives no clue what's inside. The pine cone had me really wondering if it was referring to the contents. Very confusing. Golf balls, maybe? Yep, it's golf balls. Played golf as a kid. There is literally a picture of a golf ball on the box. Okay, well, how was I supposed to know that that was a golf ball? The picture's not great quality. How was I supposed to know that? So when a cop is a female, it's a lady cop. Got it? Off-duty lady cop pokes a hole in a nasty carjacker. Ah, this, I like that we have distinguishing details here. 
Nasty Carjacker Lady Cop. Sounds like a, a great video, thanks. A male who is vegetarian or a vegan is feminine. If a male is a vegan or vegetarian for health issues such as allergies or such, or for weight loss slash dietary reasons, then it's acceptable. However, being a vegan or vegetarian for the love of animals is just plain cucked. Oh boy. I know it's not cool to say that word anymore, but you get my point. Imagine a man tucking into a cauliflower steak and a man tucking into a surf and turf. Food doesn't tell us much about our physical appearance, but it sure tells us a lot about our minds. Which man out of the two would you consider to be more masculine? Maybe I think this because of society and what's expected of a man. Maybe I'm thinking too much about it. Maybe it's Maybelline. But when I see a vegetarian or a vegan guy eating nothing but veggies, I can't help but think how his wife's son will turn out. Oh no. Are we sure? <laughs> I like I like how the the specifically say his wife's son and not his son uh, as reference to the the being cucked. Apparently this is floating around on just the internet. Okay. Oh boy, I don't know what the f any of this says. Wallacey, ma'am. Girls, oh they're ringing the fire alarm. Oh, oh they're cutting in line. Oh they're on TikTok. But the boys, oh, they're reading the Bible and they're praying, they're vacuuming, and they're even scrubbing down the mirror. Just shows how crazy things are right now. Why are they crazy? I don't know. But it has something to do with that TikTok. Puberty of girls, puberty of guys. <laughs> hey, listen, man. I still play some games that require my, my arrow keys, all right? Still playing Zuma. Some of us never no some of us never stopped playing Zuma, alright? I love my I love my Zuma. I don't even think Zuma uses keyboard. I'm just picking an old game. <laughs> Ah, yes, pumpkins, known for their male and female variety. Oh, look, the pumpkin's got a little bit of eye. Wait, hold on. No, st shut up. I think this is cute. I like the little eyelashes and the that's cute, all right? It would be great for, you know, little themed party. I like it. Evidently, there are gendered versions of Scrabble. You can get the Men's Scrabble Deluxe Travel Edition with such words like carpentry or plumbing. Only girls can craft? The Modern Girl guide to granny squares oh look granny squares granny and you're saving huge savings on the granny squares book but if you're if you're a man we gotta actually charge you double than uh you know normal price it could be 20 bucks sorry girls versus boys step through versus step over this is a heated debate on the e-bike subreddit. I'm older and remember back in the day, a step through bike was considered a girl's bike and a step over bike was considered a boy's bike. What the f is a step through, what? Oh, this bike discourse is crazy. Is there even any real debate about these about this these days or is it even a thing anymore? I had a bilateral knee replacement and step through would be ideal in my situation. But I plan on hanging the bike on my garage wall and step through might make that difficult without a top tube. Less sorry, old man. <laughs> you gotta get the girl's bike. Oh no. <laughs> I didn't even know. I didn't even know that that was a debate back then, man. That's crazy to me. Boys can make lifelong friendships. Girls can have gossip group. Oh look, the boys club is in-house activities, low cost community access, skill building, and of course, making those lifelong friendships. In the girls club, they have makeup, hair, skincare, and hair. wait, what, they got skin? Hey, wait a minute. What the hell's going on in the boys club? Why is it just, why aren't we defining what the in-house activities are? <laughs> why are they vague? Served up to me right here on Reddit. Yoga online for tough dudes led by hot girls. Men of culture, the algo reunites us again. First and only yoga online for tough dudes, led by hot girls. Absolute tens from hot spots like Sweden, France, Russia, and even the fabled No one knows where that is. <laughs> Deep stretches and peace of mind, all with a breathtaking Oh, shut up. First class on us. Join the dark side now, son. Jesus Christ. <laughs> So join the dark side now, son. That's what Darth Vader said. He said that because regular sunscreen makes you a girl. Apparently we got this straight from the cancer council, hydrating sunscreen for men. None of that pansy lady sunscreen. This is for boys, for men. 
Freely choose the gender of your mushroom reincarnation. All right, well, all that changes is the little bag I have with me. Oh, and whether I have a leaf or a flower for my foot and whether or not I'm blushing and have eyelash. I mean, a little bit of changes. I don't know, it feels like it really wouldn't bother. It wouldn't affect me too much, whether which one I choose there, does it? My fish requires a woman's CO2 scrubber. Oh, check it out. And you know how it's for girls is because it's pink. Everyone knows that pink things are for girls. Don't look at Bret Hart, because he's for girls too. Check out this. Check out these seven inches, am I right, ladies? They're sewing scissors with a cushioned grip handle, but for the ladies only. What's worse, the man cave or the she shed? I don't like the, uh, <laughs> I don't like, you know, man cave, it's like, okay, yeah, silly. Oh, she shed sounds much worse, genuinely. But anyway, let's see what they're serving there. The she shed charcuterie is a soft pretzel fried to perfection, paired with the best cheeses, meats, fresh fruits, and dipping sauces any beautiful lady would love. Goes great with a glass of wine. Why is it $4 more expensive than the man cave charcuterie? A man-sized pretzel lightly fried for crispiness, filled with hearty cheeses, meats, and dipping sauces made to go with several cold beers. Pick your pick your choice, but if you pick the wrong one, we're gonna throw a fit. We're gonna scream at you. I don't think I've seen a pink tax. Is that what that was? Was that a pink tax on a restaurant menu? Good God. Man shred? Cheese? Yeah, it's a kitchen tool for men. Dainty ladies just wouldn't get it. Didn't realize all men and women are limited to certain heights. Because as you know, if you're sitting, it's up uh, 30 inches. But if you're a family, oh, that's 43. But if you're a male, that goes up to 45. No more than 45. Any more than that, and you're some sort of crazy eldritch being. Gendered body powder. Again, it's the same exact product. I think this is just a marketing scheme, and I, it's hard for me to knock it because if I can sell two things that are the same thing, but like be able to sell them at, uh, I, I would do it. I would do it too. They're making money. It's hard to knock it. Mr. Krabs runs all these, dude. Why is the woman's one so figure hugging and the man's one is baggy if, as F? All genders deserve the slouch and baggy fit. Give us the baggy fit. <laughs> Listen, they're sexy Top Gun flight costumes. So if they're gonna be sexy, it should also be tight fitting on the man. All right, we gotta, <laughs> gotta have ball indentation on those. I'm pretty sure these smell exactly the same. They do. Hey, but look, they're the same price. No pink tax here. Look at that. Whenever I get home from school with my hair tied up, my grandparents give me BS relationship advice on how I'll get more girls if I stop tying my hair up. And one of my bus mates caught me scrolling Pinterest and called me gay on the spot. I'm a boy, mind you. Pinterest isn't gay, I have Pinterest. It's fantastic for making plans and getting inspiration. What are you talking about? This one's new to me. Female veteran, don't you get it mistaken, pal. And female veterans drive Nissan. I kind of get it. Many female veterans are dismissed or assumed to be military spouses. Maybe this person was just fed up with it. You know, maybe. And I can understand that if that's the case. I understand the need for the sign. His and her glasses. Oh, oh my. Okay. All right. Very funny, guys. Okay. All right. Now get a room, you two. Ah, yes. Drinking from a plastic cup is something that only girls do. Babe, are you sure Starbucks isn't just for girl? It's just a delicious drink. What are you talking about? Anyone can have it. It's for it's for everyone. Well, then my father lost his man status a few years ago. Any women who drive manual transmissions are gay as fuck. Only men drive manuals, and you're not a real man if you don't know what this is. You're not a real man. I like that they had to clarify satire because there would have been someone who would be very offended by this. I mean, it feels like an obvious joke even without the satire tag, but thank you for including it. You're not a real man if you don't know what a manual looks like, idiot. Don't know if this belongs here, but body structure? Do these look like real female measurements to you? He's a man. What are the lines on? Wait, that's their legs? That's them? Weird leg bend from HRT damage. Not sure if that's, what? Ah, uh, yes, uh, these are the same kinds of guys who will take a photo of a man leaning into a photo and be like, look, he's leaning in, he's cucked. He's a cuck because he leans in. 
or he's just, you know, tall. <laughs> Actual loser. I was looking up instruments because I want to learn an instrument, and I guess a flute is inherently for girls, but boys can also play it? What? Many girls choose the flute, but boys can also play the flute. I guess you didn't know. Just in case you didn't know, a flute is for everyone. No, it seems crazy, but I'm not making things up here. It's true. Found when looking through reviews for a dog toy. A pink toy for a male dog? <gasps> Beware. Oh no, the color. I cannot attest to the durability as this is a present for a friend's dog. It feels quite sturdy. It arrived very quick and when I took it out of the box, I was shocked that it was pink. When ordering, there's no option to select a color and in the picture it was green. I returned it to get another one but a male dog color and still didn't receive green but rather blue. I couldn't complain with the blue as it was nice. Just beware that the color option is out of your control. Sellers should probably have an option to choose color. I'm sure it would be easier for all involved. But the second order came quick and was happy with it. Just know that uh, pink is a girl's color and I ordered this for a boy dog. One star. <laughs> Four stars, nice. The Bible for women, plus audio. Strong women in the Bible. Old Testament, isn't the Old Testament all like bunk at this point? Like didn't the New Testament just like totally shit on the old one? Wasn't that the purpose? Why are we, why are we going through the Old Testament again? I'm not, I don't read books or the Bible or books that are the Bible. So I, I wouldn't know. Why do you like Breaking Bad? It's such a mask interest. Do you have a brain that you use? Jesse, we need to cook pink <laughs> so we could sell the girls. We need to cook, don't say bitch, Jesse. You're gonna scare them away. We need to sell them pink <laughs> There is no pink set of armor in Minecraft, but that's definitely not gonna stop them from making this cost extra, I bet. Oh, look, the pink armor, $25. $25 pink armor, great. Don'ts for wives made in 1913. I'm not even gonna lie, that is crazy to have as a book. It, it, the title is so crazy to me that I just wanna see what the hell is in it. Pulling up a PDF of it, see if they have it. So, <laughs> the, <laughs> someone's called this marriage advice for sexists, which is what it seems like. It, this, this, the title alone reads like it was made by a chauvinist for sure. Oh, apparently this author has made don'ts for husbands as well as don'ts for wives. But I guess the don'ts for husbands are like, just very like, it's not nearly the same thing. It, <laughs> the don'ts for wives is like, shut up, don't sleep, S shut up. And then the don'ts for husbands is like, don't swing twice. Horrible, <laughs> horrible. But you know, I, I guess, you know, they're a published author, I'm not. Should guys put lol and haha -ha in their texts? What do you all, what do you all think? What do I think? I'm y'all on this. I'm uh, when you say y'all, you're saying me. I think we should. I do. I put lol in so many texts. Was looking through my cookbook collection when I, 32 male, found this gem I bought roughly 10 years ago. Published 2004. Has good recipes and cooking tips, but the cover and front page didn't age well. Oh boy. Cook like a man. Oh no. Between this and the don'ts for wives thing, like there's. <laughs> it, it, I feel like there's just a lot of. A lot of boiling down that is done in books, it feels like. But from Marlboro, cook like a man. It is the last male art form. And smoke 10 packs of Marlboro Reds while you cook like a man. Otherwise, you're cooking like a girl. Pink tools equals tools for ladies. Oh my God. Wait, I have a story. Wait, 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 wait. I have a, a story that relates directly to this. So I ordered Instacart to get a tool kit and just some, some food and stuff. Uh, and the guy didn't want to purchase the toolkit for me uh, because it was pink. So he was gonna refund it and he was like, there's only a pink one here. And I was, he was very hesitant. I had to like nudge and push him in the right direction to get the pink toolkit. But was, I've never seen someone more hesitant to purchase a product. It was very silly to me that the thought I would be like, I would throw a fit over it being pink. Like it would get to my door and I'd be like, what? <laughs> you, you asshole, it's pink. That's a cute thing of a girl. That's a girl's color. And then like what? Like start crying. <laughs> <laughs> no, man. I just need tools. Give me the tools. I'm cool with whatever color they got to be. It's a wine tour, not a wine tour, men. Come on, get in. It's wine for dudes. We're going to sit in mud and drink champagne. Come on. <laughs> Bro talks. Uh, no. Wait. Oh, my God. They call it Bro talks. 
That's kind of sick. <laughs> That's funny. Because only men use incognito. Google faces $5 billion lawsuit over tracking users in incognito mode. The entire male gender. What? I mean, also anyone who has ever used that to compare flight prices without getting advertised to, that's another danger. It's another, it's another bombastic side eye. Teenage Mutant Ninja Ballerina, huh? Look, it's Mikey. And Mikey was of course the famed ballerina of the Ninja Turtles. Woman with a time machine, I am your granddaughter. Really? Men with a time machine, here's five of your books. Don't let them make the TV show until you're finished with all of them. Ah, yes, because that is what... Are you sure that's what a man would do with a time machine? That would go like... I don't know. I would go like look at dinosaurs or like cavemen or something. I'd do something fun. Not go make George R.R. R. Martin do chores. All men analyze every purchase in detail and all women are just visual buyers who buy anything that looks cute. Ha ha ha, funny. Guys, when buying an item, oh my God. Can I even read that tag? I can't, I can see sound quality, comfort type, wired versus wireless. Oh wait, I could kind of read it. I'm not gonna go in depth on here though. I'll just read you like the list. Battery life, noise isolation or canceling, durability, brand and reviews, price, extras, compatibility, return policy, testing, if possible. Yeah, we can have a rigorous testing policy to make sure that before we buy anything, it's to our standard. Girls when buying an item, so cute, how much? Well, I mean, it's got, what is that? Is that my mellow on there? Is that my melody? Brie has gotten really into uh, Sanrio, so I am I am caught all up to date with Karomi and my Melody and all of those little creatures. So yeah, it's got to grab it. Because if you have a My Melody, you're going to have someone who's going to have the Karomi version because every Karomi needs their My Melody and every My Melody needs their Karomi. It's just, it's basic math. I feel like I sped through saying My Melody and Karomi. I, I like, I, I, <laughs> I said those so fast. If a guy bought this washer fluid, his car would combust. Exactly, because it's lady car fluid. All right. So don't, don't, if you're a man, don't you dare use this. Your car will explode and you will die. Fresh off Amazon, dude what? Oh, no, 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 don't. No, not my dude wipes. No, I like the, I like the dude wipes. Listen, anything to make men use baby wipes and bidets. I don't give a shit, all right? I've used a bidet for like a year. I, I will never go back, all right? Never, ever go back. It's a total game changer. Backpacks. I was just finishing ba uh, packing a backpack. I, I almost said backing a pack pack. <laughs> My brain is, it, it was gonna slap me around a little bit for sure. We head around for a trip and then my dad comes in and goes, oh, that's actually a woman's backpack. I can get you the men's backpack. It's one of these funny looking backpacks people wear on hikes. What? Okay, apparently it does have a use. The more you know. Well, don't, don't spoil, don't, don't keep me hanging. That's the last post. What's the use? Hold on. What's the use, you're not gonna keep this from me, of hiking backpacks. So a hiking pack keeps your hands free while hiking, but ensures you bring all your essentials, such as first aid kit, water, food, extra layers. So these big ass backpacks do all of that? Okay, yeah, the more you know. I had to Google that one because I was left on a cliffhanger, but you know, you know, we learned something and that's, that's why we tune in. <laughs>